old brick maker we've talked to. These ones don't say anything. Uh, there's an obelisk over there. Oh, drowners as well. Let's just not go near them. I'm not interested in fighting drowners now. They're not worth my time. Potion base, we'll have that. Oh, out of my way. Oh, you need to cut my head off for that. What are we doing? And we'll just loot a couple of these houses and quickly run back to the clay pits and see um, if we can find anything about... about ugh, find anything out about Berengar. Jeez. Try and say that ten times fast. Uh, another book. Oh, I should probably scroll that a little bit slower so you can read it if you want. There we go. Uh, I'm going to have to get rid of something. Diamond dust. I'll get rid of that salt peter. I've only got one of it anyway. So. That's the Arca spore head. Anything in the wardrobe? Oh no, I've just looked in the wardrobe. What an idiot. Brickmaker's wife, do you have anything interesting? Any words of wisdom? In our village, the leader is the only woman to leave her home often. Why? She's old. Surely she'd leave her house less. Or is she not the leader? Oh god. Scared me standing right behind me like that. And this looks like the end of the village anyway. There's drowners out there. Brickmaker. Fool's Parsley. Nothing I'm really interested in. This house needs going quickly. Just see if there's anything else to loot. I should probably be keeping a track of time. I'm actually quite bad on that when I'm recording. I don't notice how much time <laughs> has gone by so sometimes I end up going quite making quite a long set and sometimes it ends up being rather short which is never good god you're all alcoholics in this place drinking from bottles as well um, oh geese no I can't get to the geese yay Gooses. Fly away. What's that over there? Oh, it's another obelisk. I think they're just in a big circle, the obelisks, so it should be easy to find each one. Uh, and I want to have a look at the map, because I need to have a quick walk back down to the clay pits, which is down here. Just to see if I can find Berengar's body, and then I probably want to try and find the druids, actually. There are brickmakers, look. Oh, it's because I killed all the drowners, isn't it? I think... Bearing all the dead bodies were over here. Oh, my candy's still in there. I thought they'd... You know, they said if you put something on there, they would do something. Salamander, mutilate corpse. Oh, I've had a look around here. There's nothing here. White Myrtle. Whoa, I, I can talk to this guy. Well, that was pointless. Why did it go into a cutscene thing? My father and grandfather no doubt I huh. Was there anything I picked up from here before? I can't remember. There's Sephiroth's. Uh, her grandma's diary. I don't think there is. Let's have a look at that quest again to do with Berengar. Berengar secrets. I should look for Berengar near the clay pits. Oh great, it doesn't really give me any hint as w as to where I should be going. Oh, bloody hell, there was some loud wind outside. It sounded like a plane going past. Scared the bejesus out of me. Um, probably can't hear it on the mic though. Huh. Odd. There's nothing here. Just those mutilated bodies and they don't seem to... ...give me any updates to my quest. Might have to leave that for now and then come back later. 
Yeah, because it's just salamander brooches. Not anything that I want. Where'd they even go? Oh, they're there. I've still got them. Uh, might as well collect them anyway. Why is that one now? Oh, it's a split salamander brooch. Okay, slightly different. I apologise. Uh... I followed the trail of salamandra corpses and found the place where Barango made his last stand. By the look of things, he sold his life dearly. Doesn't make sense to me. When I see Vesemir again, I'll have to tell him that th of the death of another one of our cast. Barango is dead. Sad tidings for Vesemir when I see him. Oh, okay. No. Barango, we searched for you all this time. I need to find out you died. At least we know he wasn't working with salamandra, or at least he took them on. Uh, Druid's Grove is all the way over there. I might go see Gramps actually first. See if he got home safely. Luckily the swamp isn't too big so you don't have to run around for quite so long. I mean if we go to fast style we can run a little bit faster. I keep forgetting to do that actually, it's a good trick. If we just follow this road, we should come across Gramps. That's the obelisk. Some creature thing. A cat, I think. What is that? What is going on there? Okay, that was weird. Looked like bugs just spinning around. I don't know if that was something wrong with the game. Ooh, corpse. Assassin Saga, I already have that. Let's not pick up. What a waste of time. Am I on the right track still? I get so distracted by stuff. Uh, apparently it's over here. Yeah, there we go. The path's just partly submerged. Oh, and some stuff we need to pick up that I haven't seen before. Fain weed. Fan wed, whatever it's called. Beggar tick. All drowners to kill. Come on then. If you think you can take me on, bring it. Wow. You're not much of a challenge anymore, are you? Now with my like fully powered up Igni sign. We haven't actually got um a new magic spell for a while. I'm looking forward to seeing what the next one is. But I'm still using my Igni sign until unless that other one gets powered up. And unless I descend there decide to put some points in it. I see what, if Gramps has got home, that is. Oh he is, okay. You couldn't get there by yourself, but getting back was fine, apparently. And so for Ah, oh, that's the one. You could have got this, I suppose, to give to Corkstein earlier instead of getting it from Vivaldi by paying him. But, uh, I'm impatient, so... I didn't find that out. I suppose it's always something you can do if you're doing another playthrough. Uh, I'm going to have to drop some stuff again, aren't I? Uh, I don't want to drop potions. I don't think I need the salamander brooches, to be honest, so let's just drop them. Anything in your cupboard grounds? Just food. A bit of flint. Ooh, candy. But I can't take that because it's got inventory space. Damn it. Not human bones. Brains. Nothing beats me. Wait, what? Ham sandwich, pork. Uh. Wait, what? I'm confused. Didn't they say the cannibal? A cannibal lives in a hut on the island. I must find him. I have to find the cannibal that lives in a hut in the swamps. Well, how, uh, you're not a cannibal, are you, Gramps? I'd be upset if you were. I helped you earlier. This should be my home. Is that skull and brain human? Yes. <laughs> Casually, yeah. That too? Plates. A mug. That don't get agitated. Listen to my reasons. What reasons might a cannibal have? You look pale. 
Can't you eat something? No. Oh, that's disgusting. That made me. Ugh. Ugh. That's disgusting. You don't deserve to live. I'm looking for a child after the brickmaker's little boy. I'm looking for a child. You didn't eat him, did you? Boy. What are you implying? Just asking if you've seen him. Well, I don't know anything about that. And I don't like children. I find that hard to believe. Can I speak to you? I wonder what I should do with Gramps the cannibal. Well, if you let me talk to him. You look no, I don't want to eat any of your disgusting human flesh. Shut up, you son of a bitch. Why do you eat human flesh? Well, I enjoy it. It has health-giving qualities, and it tastes like chicken. Just eat chicken, then. Now Jeez. Human flesh provides the equivalent of... Spare me. Well, you are hostile. Well, I, I do follow certain rules. For instance, I never consume chicken. Oh, that makes it so much Truly better. Praiseworthy. Exactly, Think Geralt. for sarcasm. Well, occasionally I polish up a druid or a brickmaker, but I especially save an elf. Oh, it's aromatic. That's disgusting. Naturally infused with scents of roots and spices. No, what about dwarf meat? <laughs> what about dwarf meat? Well, veiny and stringy. I, I believed I tasted it once, but in truth, I'm unsure it was dwarf meat. And to my embarrassment, I was forced to fight a drowner for it. The bloody oh, this guy's disgusting. Enough. As you wish. You don't deserve to live. Well, you, you can always kill me, but I'm, I'm of greater use alive. I have vast knowledge, and I know this swamp well. I could be of assistance to you. In what way? Like I believe you, you'll flee as soon as I leave. Like I believe you, you'll flee as soon as I leave. No, oh, I'm too old to run again. I'd not deceive you. You've come to the swamp on an important mission. Completing it must be of greater import than one old monster. And mark me, I hold answers to many questions. Uh. Uh. I want to kill him, but information.